Guys, Tank's moving great with his training. He now knows sit, stay here, heal, uh, and place. So now it's time for him to learn the whistle command, sit in here, as well as I'm going to color condition him at the same time as I do the whistle commands. A lot of people teach the whistle command earlier, and you can do that. There's no, there's, there's several different ways you can skin a cat. But the main thing is stay with your program. Don't get excited, and 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 always progress. If something gets a little rough, then you just simplify it. Move up closer, do the marks again, run the blind again, simplify, get shorter distances. That's your number one tool. Simplify, simplify, simplify. Your second number one tool is your collar. There is nothing like a sport dog collar. This one right here, I have literally 24 settings in a me uh, low, medium, and a high. This sport dog is, is by far one of the best. Now, I'm going to tell you, collar conditioning your dog correctly is extremely important. And what I mean by collar conditioning is teaching your dog how he should react to turn off any type of stimulation that you might be giving him through the collar. And it's it, first thing you got to do is figure out exactly where his level of feeling that nick is a lot of people want to use a lot of big scientific names but it's actually when you can see him kind of twitch from it that's about right you don't ever want a vocal sound coming from your dog because of the collar and and i'll be the first to admit sometimes i've had it forget what i'm doing and i have it a little bit high and i've nicked my dog a little bit harder than i wanted to it's going to happen but always always try to keep your nicks at the lowest work up from there and always that when you get exactly what you want out of your dog that's when you quit increasing the level and it's it's a very very simple tool to understand but you must understand that always give the correct amount of stimulation for the desired effect that you want out of the dog and that's always at the lowest setting possible now this collar is very easy all you do is hold a button you get a red light hit your other button boom and oh, i turned it off you get the green light you hit your button and as soon as it starts clicking red i'm good to go right now i'm on a setting number one in my medium settings i can tell that tank is going to be a dog that can actually take a little bit more. He's 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 very docile in his training, but he loves to retrieve. He is what's the correct word I'm looking for? He likes you can he gets his feelings hurt. Let's just say that. So, you know, you want to be careful with that. This tool will make or break your dog. I've seen a lot of awesome awesome dogs lose their desire to retrieve, their desire, desire to work because of too much collar stimulation. So always simplify things and make sure your dog knows what you want before you ever give him a collar correction. That's why we want to make sure that he knows his sit, stay, here, and heal. Next, we're going to, like I said, we're going to teach him that by the whistle train, but I'm going to incorporate that into his collar conditioning. And I'll show you exactly the first few steps. We're gonna put this collar on him. I think you act like you're just comfortable now sitting up here. Always keep your lead on him in case he, what we call bolts, the stimulation might, you know, it might freak him out. You wanna make sure that you have great contact through the skin to him, not too tight, but you do want it tight enough to where it can't come off. We have him turned. Like I said, to number one, I'm going to sit here and I'm going to watch him. I'm going to see, see what he does, you know, and I'm going to sit here and I'm going to turn it up until, I don't think that was it. He's just kind of just messing around. All right, right there, definitely, definitely I got this, the, the, the stimulation. That was a number three, so no great big deal whatsoever. I have a continuous button, and I have a momentary, just a, half a second or a third of a second or something like that but this continuous button is the one i'm going to use to stand on to start on right from the very beginning and i'm going to back away and i'm going to show you exactly how i'm going to do it i'm going to use the whistle and i'm going to use my voice commands and he's going to learn all this stuff at the same time but keep it simple as you see i've still got my lead on him this is in case he bolts 
I can always have control of him. I can give him the stimulation till I, I'm up at his side and that's when I'll quit. I'm gonna use the hear, tweet, 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 the sit whistle when he's at my side, but I'm gonna give him a vocal command as he's to come off to, to my side with the word here. Now, if he debolts, or if he bolts, I'm going to keep control of him and try to get to his side and end the stimulation for him when, he, when I'm at his side. But I'm also going to pull him toward me at the same time. And, at the same time. And like I said, I can tell that he's not liking this. So we're going to keep a session short, get done, you know, get two or three desired effects of it. And then, you know, I'm going to put him up, we'll have some hup ups, and we'll call it a day. Here, here, no, no, here, here, here. He went on the other side of the tree for me, so I'm gonna get over here. Heel, good, sit. We'll do that again. Good, here, 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 here. Stimulation, sit, good. You know, this lead bothered him when I first put it on him and stuff. Now. You know, it, it can get all wrapped around him. It doesn't bother him whatsoever. He's just used to it. Place, 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 place. Good, sit, sit. I gave him stimulation all the way to the stand. Took him a second, to, no, place, no, place, place, place. Sit, good. It. The second he came off, I gave him stimulation again, and it was just, you know, it's just a very, very light neck. I promise you, I'd let you put this collar on me and shock, shock me all day long at the setting it's at. It's just a minor discomfort, like somebody's scratching at you pretty good. Here, 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 no, here, good, here, not between my legs, here, sit. Good. Putting that head against me, you know, that, that, that's exactly what I want. He tried to hide between my legs. Place. Sit. Good. Sit. Sit. Now he's leaning. He's kind of leaning toward me. And that makes me think, okay, he's anticipating it. That is a great thing. Here. Here. Oh, yeah. Here. Sit. Good. Sit. Folks, I promise you, with him leading out, was telling me right then and there that, hey, I'm going to get over there because that's how it turns off. Now, if he figures out to go away and turn it off, you're halfway to force into a pile. It'll make that so much easier right after force fetch. Place. Place. Sit. Good dog. Sit. That tail starting to wag. That's all positive stuff. Here. Here. Heel. Good. Here. 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 Good. Sit. Good. Leaning that head up against me. Hey, I'm okay with that. Place. 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 Good. Sit. 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 Good. Guys, I'm going to only do this one more time, but I can tell you that he's actually learning everything, and this is exactly how you want your collar conditioning to go. Here. 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 Good, sit. Good dog. Good. Place. 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 Good. Sit. Sit. Good dog. Good dog. Sit. Take your time while collar conditioning, and I promise you, your dog will understand it. He'll get a better grasp on how to turn it off. Tank's doing a great job. All we're gonna do is keep this up, keep the whistle up, and probably within the next about a week and a half, he'll be doing a great job. I'm not even gonna worry about that. Guys, just simplify, simplify, simplify. Come on, buddy. <laughs>